Logan, everyone. Welcome to Friday. Things look great for the day and for the weekend as well. Let's take a look at what's happening. High pressure still in control of our weather, working to clear us out, diminishing our rainfall. So today we will see the sun, but we could see a little bit more cloud cover as we see some clouds ahead of this cold front that's pushing through the south. But all in all, rain chance less than 10 percent. I'll call it just sprinkles. Let's take a look at what's happening. We're looking at a southerly wind flow, picks up a lot of moisture, but we still have a lot of dry air on top of us. So that's why I can't can't rule out the rain, but I'll say less than 10% chance, and that'll be in the form of sprinkles late afternoon, early evening, if we see those. So all in all, looks good for Friday football fever, but we'll be humid for those games tonight. 88 degrees is where we're going to top out today. 88 for Sarasota, Venice, and Inglewood, also Northport. 89 Port Charlotte and Punta Gorda. 86 Boca Grande, and 86 in Lombok Key. Depending on the cloud cover, if we see less than anticipated, those numbers could go up even more. So yes, it is another warm day. Now, across the state, we're looking at 89 degrees for Tampa today. We're looking at 90 in Fort Myers, 89 Orlando, 84 Tallahassee, and 86 in Key West and Miami. Miami, slight chance of some showers. Winds out of the south for boaters, seas two to three feet. There's a light chop. If you head to the beach, water temperatures are cool, 76 degrees. UVA is a seven. Taking a look at the tropics, we do have that area of thunderstorms and clouds over the Bahamas today. We've been watching that for uh, since yesterday, and it has diminished today. Also diminishing that area of low pressure over Nicaragua, Honduras, and Costa Rica. So less than 30% chance of these developing into anything we need to worry about. Although as they track westward, that could increase our rain chance come the beginning of next week. And we'll take a look at the, the uh, six-day outlook just ahead. Taking a look at the national picture in the Midwest today, just a sloppy mess as we have rain moving from the middle Mississippi Valley, eastward through the Ohio Valley towards the Great Lakes. And yeah, a lot of travel delays here. We're also seeing this drag of cold front across the south today. And this is also pushing towards the northeast. So temperatures are down in the, in the northeast, some 20 degrees from yesterday, and we're seeing showers and thunderstorms as well. Now, in the Pacific Northwest, another cold front is dropping in as well, so we're seeing some showers, scattered showers and thunderstorms. Let's take a look at the temperatures. 50 in Boston today was 70 yesterday, 64 in Washington, 75 in Atlanta, 49 in Denver, 71 in San Francisco, 83 in Brownsville. Sunny mix for us. We could see a little bit more cloud cover today. It is humid, however, high of 88 degrees. Tonight, we're going to call for partly cloudy skies. We're going to see a sunset of 654, an overnight low of 71 degrees. Let's take a look at those next six days. Again, the weekend looks pretty good. Just a slight chance of rain continues Saturday on through Sunday. And then Monday, that's when we see that increased chance of rain. The beginning of next week, our rain chance is up. That's a look at your forecast. Thanks for logging on to HeraldTribune.com.